Hey all, welcome to Slay the Spire. Today we're playing the daily challenge for August 1st, 2019. The characters are the Ironclad and the modifiers are Insanity, started with a random deck of 50 cards. Time Dilation, all enemies start with the slow debuff. And Night Terrace, resting a rest site, seals 100% of your HP but costs 5 max HP. Let's start it. Let's briefly review the Insanity deck. Oh, uh, right, we can sort now. Let's sort by type. Okay. Ah, oh, this is so much better. All right, three angers. We already have a full set of clashes. Um, I think that's it, right? Two cleaves, headbutts, five iron waves even. That's something that we can remove if we have to. Uh, and that's pretty much it. All right, so first floor, we're going to pick up as much as possible, and then we'll try to uh, get some nice collector bonuses going. All right, in terms of maximizing elites, I only see one two elite path on the far left. Yep, we have to take that. And also, I have to remember, we have the Hexagos, so ideally, in this battle, I want to lose a lot of HP so that we don't take too much damage from the first Hexagos attack. All right, so Flex and Cleave. I probably should have waited. I forgot about the slow debuff. So, yeah, that was a mistake. Um, all right, uh, we'll do Shrug it off and then Headbutt. Damage. All right, fine. Uh, I'll put a Flex back. Should be able to kill. Yeah, if I had done that a little better, we could have avoided taking any damage, but um, it'd be safe. All right. Yeah, I have to make a habit of playing uh, skills first. Okay. All right, so this arm steering bro twin strike, I think I'll go with. Well, twin strike would benefit from the time dilation, but this arm is really powerful, especially for the uh, final boss on this floor. Um, I think we'll gain gold. I think with a large deck, it doesn't really make sense to remove a card. So I think I also won't do anything here just to save the gold. We do have a shop coming up very soon. All right, so Infernal Blade gives us Cleave. Okay. Uh, I think we can't defend. Uh, yeah, at least not fully. Let's do Iron Wave. Then um, Reckless Charge, Pommel Strike, and Cleave. Okay. Take some damage, but we will, heal, we will heal that back up with the Burning Blood. No big deal. Got a Fire Potion, and Whirlwind might be really nice. Uh, we already have a copy of Shrugged Off, but I think I'll take uh, Whirlwind just from... Well, we have Cleave. Uh, we have uh, two Shrugged Offs. You know what? Let's work on the Collector Bonus already. And it's not a bad card. Okay, Backup Preparation might not be a bad idea, but I think I should focus more on cards. Um, so probably another cleave. Back operation would be pretty good. I think I'll take it. A Savage Combat or two additional cards? Yeah. Um, do I want to take Havoc? I mean, might as well. Right, so here we can probably start upgrading with so many cards. It only makes sense to upgrade things that can become innate. Or things like the... Um, I saw it, right? Armament. Yeah, that's a card that um, once we upgrade it, it will upgrade other cards, so... Definitely one of the first contenders for an upgrade. Okay, so here we... I didn't see many powers in the deck. Actually, I don't think there are any. Well, except for the combust that we already have in our hand. Let me just double check. Yeah, I don't... Well, and I guess we have Metallicize. Yeah, fine. I think I can wait. Uh, we can... Do I want to do combust? Yeah, sure. Let's do combust. Okay. I mean, I guess I was hoping for the... Uh, Metallicize, but that's probably not going to happen. I think I do want to apply some weakness. Do Warcry first. You know what? No, let's do the weakness next turn. Okay. Alright, so here we can do Clothline, Hemogenesis, and Double Anger. A bad turn to wake him up. Okay, so he is weakened, so we have only 13 incoming, but that's still going to be a challenge for us. We can fully defend, unfortunately. Yeah, unfortunately, I'll make next turn extra hard. Well, at least we're fully defended. Another 18. So we can do flex. Sorberang will do 15. Sever Soul will do another 18. That's, uh, what is that, 33. And then the Fire Potion will bring it up to 53. That's not enough. Is there anything else? Unless Infernal Blade has to go as something good. This is th 10 times 3 which is 30, and then 50, still not enough. Uh, this has 18 by now. 
Fiend. Yeah, let's do that. Let's just warp boomerang cleave. Then uh fiend fire. Okay, and then we can actually perfect by throwing the fire potion. Awesome. A bag of marbles, I just have reached combat, deploy one vulnerable to all enemies. Uh and here. Might consider not taking any rare cards. Unless I get some good ones offered, I think I'm okay. Also, Exhum is not that great. Um, Heavy Blade, we don't really have strength. And Body Sound, we don't really have defense. But I do want to pick up something. I think we'll go with Heavy Blade and try to pick up some uh, relics or cards that gives us strength. I guess we do have spot weakness for strength always. Alright, uh, can we kill here? Uh, we can definitely kill one of them. And the other one with some damage. I think that's... Well, actually here, we can do Wall Strike and Con. Yeah, no need to take damage. Uh, another cleave, sure. Here we got oddly smooth stone starch coming with one dexterity, very nice. Next to lead, this might this one might be a little harder since we don't have any um, potions. Uh, we can do. Uh, do I want to do bloodletting? We I mean, might as well. Let's do bloodletting havoc. Okay. Then iron wave. Um, then. Flash, Flash, and Sever Soul. Wow, okay, first turn kill. Got Shovel, you can now dig for relics at rest sites, as well as a Poison Potion and um, Sever Soul or Clash. Uh, we already have enough Clashes, so I think I'll take a Sever Soul. I also wouldn't mind picking up Curses. We have enough Exhaust Energies. Uh, yeah, sure, let's gain some Gold. We should be able to heal the HP back up fairly quickly. Uh, you know what? I don't think there's anything that urgently needs to be upgraded. I mean, we have 56 cards. The chances of drawing one, well, is 1 in 56, almost. Uh, so I think we'll dig instead. Let's see what we get. Thread and Needle, that's actually amazing. Starge combo with 4-plated armor. Very good. Very good decision to do that. All right, and then, yeah, I have to remember, this is the fight I want to take a bunch of damage so that I can be better prepared for the Hexagos. So um, I'll do Spot Weakness and Flex. Oh, this is tempting. We could do 52 damage and kill one turn. But no, no, let's just uh, fully defend and just wait a little bit. Uh, wow, this would even kill. Alright, fine, we'll wait. It's okay. Alright, 12 incoming. Uh, yeah, 17 is much better here. Uh, I think we'll do Ghostly Armor, uh, Anger, and then uh, Heavy Blade. So now he's low enough on health that we should be able to kill when we have to. Demons. Iron Wave. Uh, okay, we'll wait. Oh, I forget. I'm I'm blocking. I have to lose HP, right? Uh, yeah. Let's just let's just lose some HP. I think going down. So the uh, the hexagos attacks twelve times. Uh, well, it's it's a calculation by twelve. So if we end up with less than twenty four health, he will attack with only two times six, which I think is much more doable. Um, and since we heal six at the end, uh, I am going to try to end up with exactly 17 health. Yeah, that way we'll heal back up to um, 23. Yeah, let's do that. Should have done uh, the spot weakness there. Okay, 23. This is 22. That's ex uh, no wait. I need 17, right? So yeah, I'm okay. You know what? Let's bring it down to five. Yep, that's exactly enough. Great. So let's see if it uh, if it worked out, if I calculated correctly. We got an Ancient Potion, and uh, Corruption in a thick deck like this is amazing. So I definitely want to take that. Probably one of the cards I also want to upgrade. Uh, Lantern might be good since we do have an extra card, or two extra cards in our opening hand. Uh, I also, you know what, let's take Lantern first. So I just come with additional energy. And then I think I'll take Spot Weakness since we uh, might go for a Strength deck now. That's the only thing I can afford. Iron Wave was another good choice there. Okay, here we'll dig. We got Mango. Up and pick up Racer Max HP by 14, but that will give us... All right, fine. Now the enemy is attacking for more, but the Max HP is worth it. Yeah, I think now he's going to attack four times six since we have 37. Uh, that's not much we can do about that. All right, so Flex, Havoc, the Grid. Okay, not exactly what I had in mind, but um, let's do... Uh, is there anything I want to headbutt back? Uh, yeah, I guess Havoc. Ideally something with defense, but we don't have that. So, and then we'll just do our soul. Okay. Yeah, 24 incoming. Um, well, Havoc better give us something good. Uh, we can do Spot Weakness. Havoc, which gives us Hemokinesis, okay. 
And then let's just do anger and true grit. Yeah, unfortunately, if, if we didn't get mango, my calculations were correct. Maybe I should have not accepted it. Yeah, it's 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 hard to say now, but I mean, I couldn't have predicted that we've gotten one of I think only three relics that gives you max HP. So, um, all right, now since we're not perfecting anymore, uh, I might as well do heavy blade and um, reckless charge. Yeah, that's a shame though, because I think we had enough defense if we were ta getting attacked by twelve, not not by as much as we were. All right, cleave, iron wave. Okay. Yeah, we have 10 strength, we should be fine. Yeah, just unfortunate we didn't affect this one. Got a smoke bomb that we're probably not gonna eat. Now, feed is one of those cards I will take, since max HP is something that will give us a scar a score modifier. Now, still, 1 in 58 cards. I think I'll take it, and then if I don't see any other rare cards, I'll try to remove it on the third floor. Now, I wouldn't mind energy. Actually, I also wouldn't mind smith not no longer smithing at rest sites. I'll probably dig at rest sites anyway. So yeah, let's take fusion hammer again. Energy and start of your turn. You can no longer smith at rest sites. I mean, the only card I really wanted to smith probably would be uh, the corruption. But now with four energy, we should be able to play it fairly easily. I see a three lead path. Um, we can either go on the left, which gives us three question marks before we start the elites, or on the right, which gives us two question marks and a shop. I think I'll go on the left since I really want to get curses and we have a shop towards the end uh, of this floor as well. Alright, so we can do spot weakness, intimidate, and then um, heavy blade does 20 damage. Um, you know what, let's do uh, shrug it off. Okay, then clash. You. Heavy blade, uh, you. And then pommel strike uh, before kill. And anger for you for a kill. Okay. Alright, he's not attacking, he's buffing, which gives us some time to attack ourselves. Hmm. Alright. Uh, clothesline flex metallicize. I wouldn't mind some more powers. Uh, f eh, clothesline, we have the energy. Let's take clothesline. We have the energy and apply, give us some sort of defense. Definitely don't want to take the apparitions here. Actually, do we? I guess it's too late. No, I didn't want to lose HP, and 5 out of 60 is definitely not that great. We got the boot. Whenever you deal 4 or less unblocked attack damage, increase it to 5. Alright, so um, 10 incoming here. Let's do Pummel Strike. Uh, true Grid once and twice. Okay. And then we can do a Body Slam for 31. Alright. Okay, and then here we can just do these. Yeah, Clash is being uh, surprisingly useful. Um, cleave or Heavy Blade? Let me just review. We have three Cleaves and three Heavy Blades. All right. Well, I guess I'll go with the upgraded Cleave then. Okay, maybe I should have gone with Heavy Blade since we do have the energy, but too late now. Um, let's do Combust this arm. Uh, I do want to do Iron Wave. Uh, actually, we can probably just do Shrug it off. 25. Alright, let's just shrug it off. And then cleave and iron wave. Don't take any damage. Okay, I also have to remember I have thread needle. Ooh, there's feet. Okay, can we use this? 14. Well, definitely want to do cleave. I don't think we can use it, right? Um, hang on. No, we can use on the backliner. So heavy blade and feed. Okay, so we got some max HP. This guy's gonna go berserk, okay. So let's do war crime. Uh, let's put the close line back, then play that with havoc. Okay, then shrug it off. Another close line. Intimidate and anger. All right. Got a feed off, that's not bad. Uh, headbutt or iron wave? I believe we only have three iron waves, right? Two headbutts and. Never mind, five iron waves, so I'll take the headbutt instead. Okay, first elite on this floor. Um, yeah, the fence might be a problem here. Let's see what uh, Warcry gives us. Ghostly armor. That would actually be enough. So let's actually put the Carnage back. Okay, then play that with Havoc. Ghostly armor should have done that first, probably. Uh, and then we can play everything here. Clash, Clash, Heavy Blade, and Headbutt. Uh, I'll Headbutt the Heavy Blade back. That way we are guaranteed to kill next turn. Okay. 
All right, perfect with this elite. We got Whetstone. We can pick up, okay, two random attacks. Let me first see. Blue Emulate might be nice. But no, I think we'll go with True Grid, right? That's the one card that we have copies of already. Uh, where are they? Yeah, we have two right now. Yeah, we'll take a third one. Got Headbutt and Wall Strike upgraded. Fine. Here we got Toxic Egg. Whenever you add a skill into your deck, upgraded. Very nice. Okay, next Elite. All right, so um, let's do battle. Oh, we have a Havoc. We can play that with close line. Let's do battle trends first. Okay, there's Corruption. Um, let's definitely play that. Then we can do Flex, Warcry. Uh, we'll put the Cloth line back. Yep, play that with Havoc. Actually, hang on. Let's do Cleave first. Not sure if that will be enough. 40% more damage, so that'll be 14. Let's try to play two more cards. So, Combust. Hmm, yeah, I guess I'll do... Well, yeah, fine. I have to do it now. Alright, at least it kills. And now we can do Havoc. Okay. And he is attacking for 18. Good thing he's weakened. Um, I think we can defend against this, right? Max War Crime. Yeah, there's nothing we can do to defend. Yeah, fine. Uh, let's keep the feed for later. We might be able to kill at some point. Alright, so Iron Wave, Reckless Charge, and Silver Soul. Okay. Yeah, we just got unlucky. We didn't have any defensive cards, and he was attacking that turn. So this is 10. Uh, we can do Cleave, Flash, and Feed. Okay, at least we got a Feed off of it. A question card, future card rewards, I have one additional card to choose from, as well as an Essence of Steel, which I'll take over these smoke bombs, since we we'll probably won't need it. Um, a Rage, Burning Pact. I think I'll go with Burning Pact. We have energy, so now we just need some card draw. At Oricalcum, if you enter your turn without block, gain 6 block. Very nice. Alright, Book of Stabbing again. Uh, feed in our opening turn. That's not great. Um, and no defense in our opening turn either. Alright, let's do Warcry. Okay, uh, it doesn't matter what I put back. I'm gonna draw it again. Um, you know what? I'll put the feed back, I guess. So we have 6 block plus 4, 10. So I, we could survive if we drink the Essence of Steel, which I am considering of doing. Let's do that. Alright, drink the Essence of Steel. Then uh, Hemokinesis, Body Slam, Cleave, and then I'll headbutt back the uh, Iron Wave just in case we need some more defense next turn. Okay, 21 incoming. Yeah, can we? I don't think we can kill this turn, can we? Iron Wave, Rampage. Flash. Yeah, 18. Fortunately, just barely not enough to kill. Alright, alright. So we're perfecting some, and we're not perfecting others, which is fine. We got Letter Opener. Every time you play three skills in a single turn, deal five damage to all enemies, as well as a Fire Potion, and... Uh, do we have enough angers? And I thought we... Hang on. There are three angers. Um, did we not have any twin strikes? We did not have any twin strikes. Okay, we do have one sentinel. Uh, let's just fill in the anger. Okay. And then here... If we go this way, we have two question marks and a shop. This way, we don't have a shop, so we'll go this way. At Tori, whenever you would receive five or less unblocked attack damage, reduce it to one. Okay, definitely membership card, right? Yep, membership card is 50% discount on all products. And then uh, we still haven't encountered a single curse yet, but I think we should be fine with max HP thanks to the uh, feed. Instead, let's take another upgraded armaments. Um, I'll take the Hemokinesis, we already have one in the deck, and Flame. And I think that's it, okay. Here we can dig for Blood Vial at Starvish Combat, heal 2 HP. Okay, and here we got Snake Plant. I'm a little disappointed by the lack of curses in the um, question mark rooms. Warcry gives us a spot weakness, which I'll actually hang on to. Let's put the, um, I guess, Carnage back. Okay. We'll do spot weakness. Um, pommel strike. Flash. And then um, we'll just do cleave and heavy blade for 51 damage and a kill. Got an ancient potion that I don't think we need. And uh, we already have enough angers. Wait, how many strike cards do I have? Uh, wait, can I sort them by not obtain? A to Z, there we go. 
Uh, all right, so let's see, no strike cards. Headbutt, heavy blade. Wow, we have one pommel strike, one reckless charge. So that's two. No, wait, reckless charge doesn't have strike in it. Uh, wild strike. That's why I mean. we only have two. That's uh, disappointingly low. All right. Well, so none of these. We already have enough anger. So the question is, clothesline or should we start with twin strike? I believe clothesline is. Yeah, we have three. Pick a fourth one. Okay. Here we get tiny chest and pick up gain 30 gold. You are 10% more likely to find treasure in question mark rooms. Very nice. Okay, bronze automaton. Let's see how we can defend against that if possible. All right, so let's do armaments first. Uh, then bloodletting. Flame. Drag it off, see what we draw. Okay, disarm. Hang on, he does have... You know what, let's throw the poison potion and then disarm. Okay. And then we can just do cleave and heavy blade. All right. Not a bad start. 18 incoming. Yeah, no real way of defending against that. Uh, there's corruption, but unfortunately it's not going to help us at all, right? Yeah, we only have 6 block, basically. 6 plus 4, plus maybe 3. Maybe we can kill the backliner. 25. No, I mean... Hang on, 25, 45 with the fire potion. And then iron wave would do another 8. That might be enough with the slow debuff. So then let's do Iron Wave. Okay, so now we already have 10 block. Um, 27, yeah, so we should be fine. Okay, all right. Uh, now, unfortunately, we won't be able to play Corruption, though. Which is fine. Right? Uh, hang on. Yeah, let's actually do Metallicize. And then heavy blade. And then throw the fire potion. Okay. Now we just need a headbutt to get the uh, corruption back. Alright, this guy took feed. We can keep it. Um, okay, none of them are attacking in the turn. We have spot weakness. That's a little unfortunate. Uh, I will play it so, just so we can play the clash. Let's do clothesline, anger, and do I want to clash you? Yeah, just in case, because he might be attacking us, which we don't want. Okay, 12 plus 8, 20 incoming. Let's do War Crime. Ugh. Yeah, that's not that good. Alright, uh, yeah, looks like we can't defend against this, right? We have 12, 15, but we have 20 incoming, unless we can kill that guy. I'll put the Havoc back. Let's try to kill here. I don't see a way of doing that, actually. Yeah, there's just no way we can kill. Okay, we tried. We were reasonably close to perfecting, although there's a big uh, execute attack, which I have no idea how we were going to defend against that. So uh, let's do Clothline and Havoc to play... I, I don't know. Oh, that was probably the Burning Blood, right? Yeah, Burning Pact, right. Okay. 36 in coming. Yeah, this is, uh, this is what I was afraid of. Can't really do anything about that. Let's do Havoc. Okay. And then we'll do... Uh, let's actually headbutt the Corruption back. That we can play it next turn. Okay, yeah. We have almost no defense against the 36. So this one was going to be very hard to defend against. Corruption, Flex, and Wall Strike. I mean, we have a lot of max HP, so I'm not actually worried about surviving, but definitely not perfecting this one. Okay. Shrug it off. Leave closely armor. I wonder if it would have gone differently if I had the corruption out. Um, let's put this back. We can do headbutt. Uh, I don't know. Probably the spot weakness since it's definitely going to be attacking next turn. Okay. Spot weakness, spot for mine for a kill. Alright, so let's see. Another feed, offering, or double tap. I am totally okay removing the feed and getting an extra 50 points for not having any rare cards. Feed is the only rare card we have so far, right? So, uh, and none of the... I mean, Offering is fine. Offering might be really good. It's also upgraded. But it's 50 points. The question is whether it will uh, allow us to uh, perfect fights. And out of 69 cards, I think it's very low probability. 
I think we'll go with Calling Bell here. Up and pick up between three curses and three relics. Yep. We don't need the energy. We already have enough. Got Regret, Clumsy, and Wrythe. Okay. Fortunately, Wrythe is an eight. And we got Vajra, Charge Combo with one strength. Mercury Hourglass, at the start of your turn, deal three damage to all enemies. And Charon's Ashes, whenever you exhaust a card, deal three damage to all enemies. Just need to find two more curses on the on this floor. And I should point out, for the first time in like a week, it's not the Time Eater. It's the Awakened one, which is fine. Uh, okay, two Elite Path with... S I, I'm counting seven question marks, so hopefully we'll get two shops out of that. Or two uh, qu uh, curses out of that. There's a shop over here. Unfortunately, no later shop, but it should be fine. I do want to try... I guess I have to remove the feed here, since otherwise I'm not guaranteed to remove it. We'll see. All right, so flex. Uh, I should have armaments first. That was silly. Um, let's do... Um, probably kill the Exploder first. This will do 27. Actually, Headbutt is enough, so let's kill you next. I'll do Anger you and Headbutt you. Uh, I'll headbutt the armaments back. Okay. Alright, uh, here let's do Iron Wave. Okay, that's probably... Actually, let's do armaments first and then cleave. Alright, we'll be dead next turn with the Mercury Hourglass. Yep. Okay, uh, Swerper Rank, True Grit. I believe we already have enough True Grits, right? Uh, we definitely have enough... Uh, no, we only have three headbutts and three True Grits. Uh, uh, Alright, fine. I'll take the upgrade to grid then. Um, well, this would give us a bunch of gold as well as the two curses I was looking for. Yeah, let's do it. Malady is an uh, annoying curse though. Duplicate a card in your deck. I am thinking of duplicating, uh, duplicating the um, corruption. Slightly increasing the chances of, uh, of us actually getting it and playing it. Maybe that's not the best decision. Maybe I should duplicate something that I have three copies of. I want to get a fourth. Like Heavy Blade. Uh, actually, maybe something like Spot Weakness. Yeah, let's do Spot Weakness since I do want to... Ideally, we would duplicate an upgraded card already. The True Grid. Um, yeah, I believe we only had three, right? Now, let me review it this way. True Grid, we had... No, we have four. Okay, never mind. We have four True Grids. Anything else that's already upgraded that I want to duplicate off? Maybe another Headbutt? Upgraded Headbutt? Might not be a bad idea. Uh, no, armaments, right. Uh, let's, uh, duplicate one of the upgrade armaments. There it is. Okay. Alright, so we already have curses, so I'm not too focused on the question mark rooms. Ah, uh, well. There's the, uh, normality in opening hand. Let's, uh, well, we can get rid of it uh, with Sever Soul. Let's see if, um, there are other skills I want to get rid of. So let's do Flex. Warcry. Um, I'll put the, uh... Give me Kinesis back. And then we can do Sever Soul for um, 34 damage. Oh, that's not bad. Okay, and then Swarp Boomerang. Alright, that actually went pretty well. Okay, 24 incoming. Uh, we can do Heavy Blade. Uh, 1, 2. Yeah, we can play everything here, right? Yeah. Let's do Disarm. Then. Uh, Anger, Hemokinesis, hang on, Heavy Blade only does 20, yeah, so we should do Hemokinesis and Heavy Blade, okay, so we're still, oh right, thanks to the uh, Oricon, we actually don't take any damage, this guy's coming back to life though, and then here we can do, um, yeah, let's do Corruption, Odd Weakness, Ghostly Armor, Burning Pact, and then uh, Home Strike for a kill. Maybe I should have waited for a feed. Yeah, that might have been a mistake. Uh, I believe I don't have enough Shrug It Offs, right? Shrug It Off. Yeah, I only have three. Let's take a fourth one. Okay. Yeah, I think here we have to remove the feed. Otherwise, I'm not guaranteed uh, that it will be removed later. Uh, definitely want to take another Swap Boomerang. We have a lot of golds, I think. Unfortunately, we don't have any X cost cards, right? So Chemical X is just wasteful. But I'll take Frozen Egg whenever you add a power card into deck upgraded. No, first Incense Burner. Every six turn, gain one intangible. Well, might as well. We have the gold to support it. Uh, let us remove the feed. Again, I'm only doing that to get, an, uh, to get an extra 50 points. If you don't have any rare cards, you'll get 50 points. Let me actually just sort by... Uh, I guess I don't have sort by rarity. That's fine. Pretty sure we don't have any other rare cards. 
Uh, in terms of cards, we can pick up another Havoc. Let me see how many clotheslines we have. Clotheslines. Wait, did I do A to Z? Yes. A to Z. Well, that's what I get for trying to sort A to Z. My game crashed. Uh, luckily, we can just take off where we stopped. Um, so we do have enough clotheslines. I don't think we need extra ones. Uh, I think I did take Havoc. Definitely want to take Sword Boomerang. Um, I will take Power Through just because it's a powerful offensive card. And I mean, we have the gold. You know what? Let's take Feel No Pain 2. Panic Button, my favorite. And I'll take Transportation as well. And of the um, potions, I'll take the Dex Potion. And then I will remove the feed as I did before. There it is. Okay. So we are losing the 15 HP that... Uh, the 15 points. No, 25 points we would have gotten from getting more max HP. But we're also gaining more max HP. Uh, 50 points from not having any rare cards. Wait, I said there are only two elite paths, right? Yeah. We'll go this way to hit one more question mark. Well, I'm not 100% sure why we're going for question marks since we already have enough curses. Alright, 13. Yeah, we need to draw something defensively. Otherwise, we won't be able to defend. Uh, let's see what Pommel Strike gives us. Mm-hmm. Burning Pact. Uh, Alright, so that's 12 defense. And I guess we have the uh, Plated Armor. Okay, good. We need two energy for that. Uh, let's do uh, Anger, Iron Wave, Iron Wave, and then Sword Boomerang for 27. Okay. That was close. Got lucky with that Iron Wave. I guess we should pick up more defensive cards too so, since I am noticing that we're lacking those um, so let's do disarm iron wave and then transmutation back of all trades panic button yeah I think he's guaranteed to not attack twice in a row so let's do panic button and then panacea okay uh, I'll do metamorphosis why not and clash yeah, so he's attacking, uh, the pattern is that he can't do the same action more than twice. So he's been attacking twice, so he's not going to do that again. Have it place drop kick, okay. And then I think I'll just do anger cleave. Alright, I'm a little worried. We only have two more turns. Okay, he's not attacking the turn we have spot weakness, of course. Uh, I think I'll just do double close line here, right? Yeah. Okay, apply some weakness. Okay, now the fun starts. 21 incoming. Panic button is going to be death here since we are... Um, he's guaranteed to attack next turn. Uh, actually, we can true grit... Yeah, let's do that. True grit the sentinel. Um, and then we can do... Oh, wow. Yeah, we, we can too. Let's just do sever soul and heavy blade. I mean, it doesn't make sense to do panic button now since we're guaranteed to take damage next turn. So, uh, I guess we're intangible this turn. Hang on. I wonder if that was the wrong decision. Uh, let's do Sword Boomerang here. I'll do Flex, Intimidate, Havoc. Okay, and then Warcry gives us nothing, right? Okay. 28, well now... Yeah, I should have done Panic Button. That was silly. Well, let's see if that will save us here. Armament, Spot Weakness. That still doesn't save us. And now we actually notice why having Curse is not a great idea in a deck full of Clashes. Okay, 32. Alright, armaments. Uh, yeah, this is a problem. Yeah, I guess I have to do part through and then I won't be able to play the clash, which is fine. Okay. 36. Wow, that's that's a really bad hand here. Um, I'll headbutt back. Probably... Yeah, I can't really decide. I'll headbutt back the power through. We, I think, need defense more so than anything else, really. Mm -hmm. 53. Uh, Alright, let's do Inflame, Spot Weakness, Power Through, and then Headbutt, another Power Through. Alright. Yeah, we need to kill very soon, otherwise we're uh, in a very bad sh uh, shape. Uh, let's do... I We might be able to. So let's do, hang on, we have four energy, one, two, three, four, or four, okay. So can we kill here? I don't think so, so I'd rather defend. Let's do power through, anger, iron wave, and then this does 57. 27, 54, are we dead? 
Yeah, we have 54 plus 3 is 54 plus 3 is 57. No, no, no. Let me... Uh, <laughs> this is a little bit cheating. Let me restart, though, since I had a dex potion. I, I, for some reason, I thought we would have more defense, but clearly it didn't work out. Let me try this one more time. Probably do everything the same as I did before. So, pommel strike. Tried to find some defense. Burning pact. Also fix that one error I did. All right, uh, so we have... Yeah, two iron waves here, okay. Okay, and then anger spore boomerang. All right, so far so good. You know what, I'll drink the dex potion now since I know I will need it. Okay, uh, here we'll do this arm. Iron wave. Okay, yep, we're fully defended. And then uh, transmutation. Yeah, same thing as before. Uh, we don't even need panic button at this point. We are fully defended. Okay. I guess I could have done panic button to be able to play clash. Not a big deal. Hopefully. Okay. Um, here we'll do havoc. Okay. Yeah, I think this is the same as before. I guess I could true grid just to trigger the Charon's ashes one more time. Again, also not a big deal. I hope double weaken here. 21 incoming. Um, yeah, next turn we're intangible, so I am willing to play the panic button here. Uh, let's actually do that first. Okay. Then uh, true grid the sentinel. Wait, this will give us two energy. Yeah, and then we can play ever soul and heavy blade. Okay, so now we're intangible. Um, intimidate war cry. Um, all right, Havoc, and Warcry. I should have done Flex first, that was a mistake. Yeah, I did not plan this turn well. At least we haven't taken damage yet. Um, all right, so Armaments, Spot Weakness, and Iron Wave. Now we're starting to take damage. Okay, 32. Um, another Iron Wave, Power Through. Regret the wound and then anger. Okay. No damage in this turn. 36. Yeah, this is this is the turn we're just basically just taking 36 damage head on. I'll put the power through back. Okay. Alright. 53. Now he's not weakened anymore. Spot weakness and flame. Power through and headbutt. Power through once more. Fifty-eight. Uh, yeah, this is the turn we died last time, right? At least we have way more to, uh, HP this time. So let me just do this again. Uh, we will try to defend as much as possible. So power through, iron wave, and then I think I'll do anger and uh, heavy blade for fifty-seven. Okay. Mm, intangible again. Very good. Uh, let's do... We can play everything here. Havoc. Okay, awesome. Yeah, we almost died here. We got meat on the bone. A few HPs at or below 50% at the end of combat. Heal 12 HP. As well as another sword boomerang. Let me check how many headbuds we have. I don't believe we have enough. Oh, we have three. And sword boomerangs, we have two. So I th I'll collect the uh, collector bonus for headbutt. Okay. Uh, here we got Kunai. Every time we play three attacks in a single turn, they gain one dexterity. That's very nice. Uh, do I want to dig here or do I want to rest? I actually wouldn't mind resting. We do have an elite coming up soon. Let's rest. We already have 25 relics, so I don't think we need more. Oh, right. We lose max HP. I totally forgot about that. Luckily, this is still enough for the modifier, so we have the buffer. We got Bottle Fame up and pick up choosing attacks. So I just come with this card in your hand. Um, is there anything I desperately need in my opening hand? I don't know, maybe almost strike just for draw. Leave for AoE. Zero cost anger. Do have five energy. I'll take Palm Strike just for the draw. Alright, another shop. Uh okay, I think we can afford everything here. Um so I'll take definitely a mind blast. Yep, it's not a rare card. I'll take a Regal Pillow whenever you rest. Actually, we don't need that. Red Skull, while your HP is at or below 50%, he'll, you have three additional strength. Boulder, and pick up, choose, uh, brew five potions. I mean, might as well. Uh, I'll take the fruit juice, drink that right away. 
and then of these, I think I'll just take the Essence of Steel, and instead of the Ancient Potion, I'll take the um, Vex Potion. Yeah. Okay, uh, we'll take another Metallicize. Let me check how many Warcries and Havocs we have. Um, so Havoc is... We have three Havocs, so definitely taking one of those, and only two Warcries. As I'll stick take, take one of those. And then I'll take Rampage too, although we're not really close to anything there. And I think that's it. Okay, that was good. We got a shop there. Use that uh, gold we got from the Normality. Well. Okay, so this does uh, 123 damage. That's pretty good. Uh, let's do this first, and then Iron Wave. You know what? I'll do uh, Mind Blast, Headbutt, and then Pommel Strike. No, let's do Mind Blast. And then uh, just headbutt the Mind Blast back. The next turn we should be fine. Okay. Uh, here we can do Mind Blast and headbutt once more. Alright, this is going well. So far. Okay, uh, here we can do Mind Blast once more. I'll do Havoc just to see what it gives us. Okay, Warcry. Um, I'll put Headbutt back. That we will be able to uh, get another Mind Blast. Okay, 57. This might be a little tougher. War Crime gives us True Grit. Uh, yeah, I don't think we need two. Uh, let's do Anger, Headbutt, the Mind Blast. Then Close Line and True Grit. Okay, fully defended here. Okay, Mind Blast still does enough damage, and yeah, that's enough. Okay. Alright, uh, here, I believe we have enough True Grits and Spot Weakness. Let me check. Flex, Anger, True Grit. Do we have enough Angers? We have enough... Uh, we only have two Flexes. And then, uh, I totally forgot about the other rest. True Grits, we have enough of. And Spot Weakness, I think we might need one more. Yeah, we only have three, so let's take another one. I'm getting some good collector bonuses. I'm very happy about that. Okay. Ooh, uh, we do have normality here, which might be annoying. Uh, let's kill one of you, the stronger one. And we're intangible here too, that's pretty nice. Uh, let's just then do uh, clothesline and palm strike. Okay. Right, and here we should be fairly... Oh, right. Almost there. Okay. We got Nunchaku. Every time we pay 10 attacks, gain extra energy. Very nice. Um, don't think we have four armaments. We only have three, right? So let's take a collector bonus for that. Okay, we got the Nemesis. Let's see if we can perfect this one. Um, Mind Blast has 126. Let's see, let's do War Cry. Uh, yeah, definitely put a spot weakness back. I think I'll do Reckless Charge. Um, one, two, yeah, let's do Sever Soul. Okay, and then Mind Blast for enough to kill. We got Smiling Mask, the Merchant's Card of Service, now always costs 50 gold, as well as a Blood Potion we don't need, and um, let me check on Flex and Reckless Charge. I don't remember how many Flexes we have, only two. And we definitely don't have enough. Yeah, we only have one reckless charge. So I'll take another flex. Maybe this gives us one more. An extra 25 points. A collector bonus. That's pretty good. Alright, so Mind Blast kills. Let's kill one with uh, a lot of uh, blocks. So let's do power through. Then Mind Blast the stronger spiker. Okay. And then Heavy Blade is 30. Yeah, that's enough to kill, right? Okay. Alright, neither of them is attacking, very nice. Hearing blow does 14, that's not enough. Let me just play some more cards. Flame, Sentinel, and then, yeah, this is enough to kill now. Okay. Alright, uh, shrug it off. Havoc. Yep, he's dead. Okay. Metallicize, True Grid, Uppercut. Uh, we ha have enough True Grids, and I guess I'll take Metallicize. It's upgraded. Alright, let's dig one last time. P 
Paper Frog, enemies with Vulnerable, take 75% more damage rather than 50. That's very good for our opening turn. Alright, so might as well drink the Essence of Steel and the Dex Potion. Let's throw the Explosive Potion, might as well. Okay, so Mind Blast does 150 damage. That's 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 a good amount of damage. And we're intangible this turn too, very good. Um, Alright, let's do Mind Blast. Headbutt the Mind Blast back. No, let's do... Hang on, we don't need to shrug it off, right? Let's do Havoc. Yeah. Okay, then Headbutt. Mind Blast back, and then Cleave. Okay. I had extra energy. How did I miss that? Hmm. Hopefully that won't haunt us. Okay, so we have Flex. Then Mind Blast for... Oh, almost kill. Not, not there yet. Not completely there yet. Um, so we can do Karn. No, hang on. Let's do Iron Wave. We need to do Iron Wave for defense. Okay. And then we'll do Mind Blast for 102. Yep, that's enough to kill. Okay. Killed everybody. So far, so good. Alright, 40 incoming. This might be a challenge. Uh, shrug it off. Ghostly Armor. Yeah, that's just not enough. We're so close to... Yeah, we we are just missing four four HP to be able to perfectly. Well, we only took one damage, but still. Yeah, that's a shame. That's just that's just a shame. Such a bummer too. Oh no, now at least this turn we couldn't have. Even if we perfect the last turn, this turn we couldn't have. So not much we could have done against that. Um, let's disarm. I'll do anger and true grit. Yep, perfect. Yeah, that's a problem when you have 92 cards. Although, if we got lucky with more headbutts, getting some of the Mind Blasts back, that would have been uh, would have been definitely nice. But, um, can't always control that. Okay, we're intangible here too. Um, spot Weakness, Battle Trance. I'll just headbutt the Mind Blast. It should still be pretty powerful. Okay. Um, eh, I guess not, well, it's not bad. Not as powerful as I'm used to, but still. Uh, let's actually just do Mind Blast here. One more Headbutt and we should be done. Yeah, unfortunately, well, hopefully we got a lot of, um, a uh, high score from the, uh, what do you call them? The, uh, Collector Bonuses. And I guess we have the Curses, so that's good. Um, just need one more attack here. There it is. All right. Let's see what our score was. Okay, fourteen sixty nine. That's not bad at all. Um, all right. So we got I like shiny and light speed. That's pretty good. We got four out of uh, what is that? Seven elites. And wow, we didn't get any of the uh, bosses. Yeah, I guess the first one. We had Mango, so we had too much HP. The second one was a big attack. And yeah, we didn't get any of the bosses. That's unfortunate. We did get Curses, Well Fed, and then I did get the... Um, hmm. Did, we, did I pick up a rare card by accident? Because I removed the feed specifically so that I can get... Oh, the Transmutation. Well... That was really silly. I rarely used it either. That could have been an extra 50 points. Ah, uh, that's so dumb. It's always... I look for rare cards in... Uh, for, for red rare cards, but then I always miss the colorless ones. This is the second time I miss the colorless one. So we could have easily had 15, 19. 50 more points. Ah, uh, that's a shame. That's a shame. Oh, well. Let's see how we do in the rankings. It is early in the day. Yeah, we're second right now. And we could have easily done 1519. That's a shame. Um, I'll check again tomorrow uh, before our next daily to see how far we fell down since um, I do expect people to be able to perfect at least some of the bosses. But uh, overall, it was a fun run. So thanks for watching. Bye.